Hey guys, what is going on? This video is a follow-up from my previous video about the new Apple Watch Series 6. If you haven't already watched it, click the link above. Otherwise, in this video, we'll be discussing the specs and features of the new Apple Watch. While the Apple Watch Series 5 was light on new features, the rumor mill has been churning and it looks like the Apple Watch Series 6 will offer much more. Improved performance and water resistance. If a research note from the infamous Ming-Chi Kuo is to be believed, and given his track record, they generally are. The Apple Watch Series 6 should feature not only improved performance, but improved water resistance as well. As first reported by Mac Rumors, Kuo explains in the note that advancements will be made possible thanks to Apple's switch from polymide PI to liquid crystal polymer LCP for flexible circuit boards. While all current series of Apple Watch feature PI made circuit boards, the Series 6 will sport an LCP flexible circuit board that will allegedly provide a bump in performance. This is the thing missing from the current Series 5 when compared to the Series 4, with the only real additions being built in compass and always on display. While Kuo doesn't explain the reasons behind the claim, he has also predicted that the Apple Watch Series 6 will offer improved water resistance. Considering the Apple Watch is already water resistant to a depth of 50 meters, what more could Apple add? One option is to add support for intense water activities such as scuba diving and water skiing, but this is purely speculation. Sleep Tracking It's been rumored for quite some time, but Apple could finally be gearing up to release an Apple Watch with built-in sleep tracking. No need for any third-party app or additional hardware as it is the case right now. Finally, the Apple acquisition of Bedded back in 2017 starts to make sense. As first picked by 9to5Mac, the functionality is referred to as Time in Bed Tracking within iOS 13 source code and features a note describing the functionality, specifically mentioning the use of Apple Watch. It reads, you can also track your sleep and get woken up silently by wearing a watch to bed. At the end of April 2020, a Twitter user named Nikias Molina gave his back into sleep tracking rumor for the Series 6. And if that name isn't familiar on the Apple rumor circuit, the name of John Processor definitely is. And he confirmed Molina's statement. This is all in line with Bloomberg report claiming that Apple was testing sleep tracking on the Apple Watch way back in February 2019, with Mark Gurman stating that Apple planned to roll the feature out by 2020 if the testing was deemed successful. There is also evidence for a sleep tracking focused watch face after the discovery of Clickface's burrito string, with burrito being Apple's internal codename for sleep tracking functionality. While there is a possibility that it will be pushed up to Apple Watch Series 5 owners via a software update in 2020, we think Apple will wait until it releases the Series 6 with, we assume, improved battery life to offer tracking all day and all night too. Micro LED Display The OLED display on the Apple Watch is a power drain, and that's partly why Apple is rumored to be ditching OLED tech in the next gen Apple Watch. Citing sources with knowledge of Apple's supply chain plans, Chinese site Economic Daily News claims the Apple Watch Series 6 will feature a micro LED display. The main difference between the two display types comes down to light emitting compounds. Micro LED displays are thinner, brighter, and less power hungry than OLED displays, which could allow Apple to create an Apple Watch with longer battery life and slimmer form factor. It's worth noting that Bloomberg's Mark Gurman reports a slightly different timeline, claiming that it will appear in 2020 at the earliest with full adoption across the Apple Watch and iPhone plan for the next 2 to 4 years. So take this one with a pinch of salt for now. Anxiety Monitoring in the tweet, Nikias Molina, backed by John Processor, said we should expect the Series 6 to offer anxiety monitoring. We're not sure how this would work, since mental health is far harder to monitor electronically than, say, blood glucose levels. Would there be an app similar to Breathe that checks in with the user's state of mind once or twice a day, perhaps? We will have to wait and see. In Screen Touch ID the next Apple Watch could feature upgraded security in the form of Touch ID, but unlike the iPad or the Mac, it will be built directly into the display itself. As it stands, the Apple Watch is secured via a 4 digit pin which the wearer taps into the display. It will stay unlocked as long as the watch can detect a heartbeat. 
allowing you to read notifications, unlock your Mac, make contactless payments and everything else you can do on the Apple Watch. Unlocking is admittedly a quick process, but it can be a bit fiddly on a small display and is certainly not as slick as Face ID or Toss ID. The rumoured Toss ID upgrade comes via a patent published in November 2019. It suggests Apple is making progress on under-display fingerprint reader technology, similar to that used on 2019 flagships including the Samsung Galaxy S10, OnePlus 7T and Hawaii P30 Pro. The patent states how the display could provide an input surface for one or more input devices, such as touch sensing device, force sensing device, temperature sensing device and possibly a fingerprint sensor. I just want to end this video with a quick question which you can answer in the comment section down below. If I told you the most powerful computer was developed thousands of years ago, would you agree with me? That's the topic for our next video, so subscribe to stay alert when it gets released. And while you're at it, don't forget to hit that like button. See you again.